Welcome back. Dogs from all over the world will compete in the Bluegrass Classic Dog Show this weekend. And today we welcome Bonnie Massey, president of the Lexington Kennel Club, with details on the event. And also Dr. Jennifer, Jennifer Carl Howard with um, Charlie, who will be competing as well. Thank you all so much for being with us. Thank you for having us. Well, tell us a little bit about uh, the show. We're so excited. We've worked a whole year in uh, reference to putting on this classic dog show. It's made up of three kennel clubs, Northern Kentucky, Mid-Kentucky, and the Lexington Kennel Club. Um, we, it takes an army to pull off something like this. We have 1,500 dogs every day. Um, it's a lot of fun. For $5, you can come out, load up in the car, and get in and see all kinds of breeds. We have 148 different breeds every day. And um, what's special about Charlie is that this is going to be a uh, new category for um, dogs to compete in, right? Right. The American Kennel Club has just opened it up to where mixed breeds, or what we call the all-American dog, to enter in um, obedience and rally. And so uh, Dr. Carl here is showing Charlie for the very first time. And what has that been like, being able to uh, include um, Charlie in the competition? We're excited. This is something that we've worked toward for a long time. We've trained hard, and she's a special needs dog, so she's come a long way with where she began. And we're excited to be able to compete in this event. And um, we'll put you on the spot here. She's, she seems very well trained. You were giving her some commands uh, a, a minute ago. <laughs> Today, maybe not tomorrow. <laughs> So, yes, no, she's done very, very well. She's got some Australian Shepherd in her. She's very willing and wants to please. So she's trained very, very well for me. She's two years old. Well, indeed. And uh, you also have uh, some other dogs that are here in our studio. Right. Tell us about them. Right. We have Kate, which is a uh, Finnish champion, an English Springer Spaniel. And uh, she's going on nine years old. So she's been in the show world for a long time. We have a little um, French bull named Lulu. She's a very young dog, about a year and a half, two years old, and she's also best of breed. These dogs hope to win their breed, best representation of their breed, and move on to best in show. So, so we start early. If you're wanting to see a lot of different breeds, there's 148 different ones with some rare ones. You can come out and see just about anything. And then as we work toward best in show every day, we'll have a new ch a champion every day, best in show. And then um, the next day we start all over. If you don't win today, you, win the, you might win the next day. This is uh, Thursday through Monday, different show every day. We have vendors out there that have everything you could think of to, to purchase for your four-legger. And this is out at the Kentucky Horse Park? In the campgrounds. All right. And do you have to get tickets in advance, or can you just uh, get them well, that day? Well, it's best to just come out in a car load for $5. You get right in. Um, you come early in the day. You get to see everything. Obedience and rally uh, will be done in the mornings. Um, is to, for the heat. Uh, prepare for the day. Plan to spend three or four hours out there. Uh, we, um, you know, there's just so much to do. It's just, uh, it's amazing. We do offer, um, if you're needing to know how a dog show runs, you can come and just check in at the front and they'll tell you where to go. But we have uh, meet the breeds at noon on Saturday and Sunday. So if you're wanting to get up close and personal and, and touch some of the dogs and talk to the handlers, you can do that. Uh, we have Best Puppy in Show on Saturday and Sunday. Mm -hmm. So Cute. <laughs> well, sounds like certainly a lot to take in over those uh, days from uh, Thursday through Sunday. As Monday. Said, or sun through, through Monday, so several days there to get it in. And again, at the Kentucky Horse Park, and you see the Lexington Kennel Club website at the bottom of your screen if you're interested in getting more information and seeing more on the event. Thank you so much for Thanks being for having us. Thanks for having us. And thank you, Charlie. She's asleep. <laughs> <laughs> She's worn out being on live television. It's hard yeah, work, I know. <laughs> well, we will be right back with a check of your forecast for the events out at the Horse Park this weekend. Thank you. It's going to heat up as we move through the next few days, but the early part of the week is fantastic. Details on how cool we get tonight after the break.